Um, so is this pretty much the biggest meet you've ever, you've ever run in? Um, I think... Yeah. I think it's in the top five, but going to like I knew, a couple know, world championships, that's pretty big. And making the finals of like the senior meets, yeah, those have been pretty big meets. Um, so you're going to the finals, is that right? Yes, ma'am. Um, how does that feel? Um, it's, it's very rewarding. Um, I'm, just, I'm just very thankful that like I've been staying healthy and I've been putting the training in to like, get this far. Was it harder than you thought? Um, it wasn't, and I was... I was expecting good competition, so I was really looking forward to it. You a ton this year, right? Yeah. Um, it's been mostly my coach trying to save me and keep me from injury, because I'm I'm working on my form to get better for shorter distances. So in practice, I've been working working on that, and then in meets, I've been working on 800 in a mile. Is there any specific like tweets you made to your running form? Um, mostly knee drive. Working on that and like shortening my stride lengths because I do overstride a lot. How has it been adjusting to the collegiate level? Yeah. How do you really adjust it? Um, my team, they've been very supportive like from the start since I got here and especially Jasmine Frey, my training partner. So it's been wonderful having her as like an older sister and someone to look up to. Do you get any, I guess, did anyone ever reach out to you about tying pro from like agent, shoe company? Is that something you wait or consider? I don't know. I have waited and consider it, but no one has, has pursued me. And I'm not really worried about that, I guess. The times, once the times come, that'll take care of itself. But I'm just trying to like enjoy the season and finish it. So did that make it sort of, I guess, an easy decision to go to college with no... Um, I know I had the potential to go pro, but I did want the experience of a collegiate team and winning a team title with them. So do you feel like you're capable of, I guess, more you've than you've shown so far this year? Than your best time for yeah, yeah. I wanna. I have big goals, and I feel like this season was a was an adjusting season and a building season. So I know outdoor would be would be so much better. Kind of building off of that, what have your first few months at A and M been like? Yeah, it's been. It's been fun. I didn't think I would like it so much. I really do like college and I like school. I like everything. So, I don't know, being able to adjust so well, I feel like that's contributed to my performances on the track and off the track in, in workouts. Um, are, you, are you from around here? I'm from New York. Oh, okay. Yeah, so, cold New York. Big adjustment. Yeah, and I do love the weather as well. So, I don't know, it's, it's really perfect for me. Um, Any goals this year? Can you elaborate on that? Yeah, um, breaking two minutes, that's always been my goal. And I mean it. It's not just like, oh yeah, everyone wants to break too, but I really do. I train, I train for it. So I'm just waiting for the right race and for my mind to be in the right spot. So tomorrow you'll um, run with your quote unquote big sister. What's yeah. that gonna be like for you? Um, it's gonna be. I know it's gonna be really fun. I feel like having her in the race is very comforting because I know she's going through the pain I'm going through, and and we're, we can push each other because because we both don't want to lose. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's, it's really something. It's it's a lot more intense than high school. So I don't know. I do a lot of tutors. Um, I'm an engineering major, so it's it's really something. Why'd you pick that one? Um, I love math and science, so like I enjoy going to class. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's it. But do you think do you think you know if you run if you run you know sub two this year? Yeah. You know, there, there were going to be some professional offers probably. Mm -hmm. And you know we saw Rachel Rogers last year. She's yeah. Time pro early. I mean, is that something? Would you try to continue your degree even if you do go? Definitely, because yeah. I don't know. I was like, I just find all the science stuff so interesting. So I do want to keep learning about it and learn about the rest of the world outside of running. Mm -hmm. right. Tammy, I yeah. missed it, but tell us about what, what what's going on in the middle of the season. Yeah, you had a race, you DN after race. What's yeah, been going on. Okay, um, when I didn't finish, it was a 400, and my hamstrings were just really tight, so I wasn't wasn't gonna risk it for like an event I wasn't that strong in. So. I don't know, I've been, t I've been sending out a lot of meets just to build my strength up and, and get the confidence in workouts so I have it in a, in a race. How do you get stronger for special races in the Yeah, because yeah. it's more important, yeah. definitely. So just mm -hmm. took the time off and, and got stronger and yes, dealt with a hamstring. Yeah. <laughs> do you feel 100% now? I, I really do, especially mentally. I feel like I can do anything and I just need to, I just need to show it tomorrow, definitely. Mm -hmm. Thanks for the time.